The F-35 fighter jet is the most lethal and connected fighter in the world. They give pilots an advantage against the enemy, allowing them to carry out their mission and return home safely. The Israel Defense Forces IDF, sent its warplanes targeting 200 points in the Gaza region, especially where Hamas forces are located. Israeli warplanes targeted the residences and command centers of Hamas forces. Israel has a more conventional military force than the United States or Britain. Meanwhile, Hamas is a well-armed guerrilla organization. In terms of air power, the Israeli military uses several fighter jets, including the F-35 Lightning II obtained from the US. Why the F-35 fighter is now the most dominant fighter aircraft and the fighter aircraft desired by many countries. It is all influenced by the sophistication of the technology possessed by the F-35. F-35A, a conventional takeoff and landing CTOL, aircraft that will replace the United States Air Force's F-16 Fighting Falcon from 2011. F-35B, a short takeoff and vertical landing style. Aircraft that will replace the AV-8 Harrier II and F-A-18 Hornet of the United States Marine Corps and Italian Navy and the Harrier GR7-GR9 of the United Kingdom from 2012. F-35C, aircraft carrier aircraft that will replace the F-A-18 Hornet, AB-C-D variants only, of the United States Navy from 2012. The F-35 fighter aircraft has various features and sophistication of modern technology. Currently the F-35 is a fighter aircraft that is the target of some countries in the world for the purpose of increasing the strength of their air fleet. But what makes this fighter aircraft so great and is the target of many worlds? Here is a little explanation about the F-35 fighter aircraft. Before discussing too far, first need a little knowledge about cost. What is meant here is the cost of making the F-35 fighter. Listen to the explanation. A U.S. Navy study found that the F-35 would cost 30 to 40 percent more to maintain than current fighter jets, a figure that does not include or take into account inflation over the F-35's operating life. A Pentagon study concluded $1 trillion in maintenance costs are needed for the entire fleet over its lifetime, a figure that does not account for inflation. The F-35 Fighter Program Office found that in January 2014, the cost for the F-35 fleet over its 53-year life cycle was $857 billion. Costs for these fighters have been falling and account for a 22% life cycle decline since 2010. Manufacturer Lockheed stated that by 2019, the price for the fifth-generation aircraft will be less than its fourth-generation predecessor. The F-35 in 2019 is estimated to cost $85 million per unit complete with engines and full mission systems, inflation adjusted from $75 million in December 2013. The U.S. is very serious about increasing the strength of its air fleet to become stronger. It is evident about the U.S. plan, the U.S. by spending such a large budget. What kind of technological sophistication is installed on the U.S. F-35 fighter? Armament. The F-35 fighter is armed with the GU-22-A, a four-barrel version of the 25mm GU-12 equalizer cannon. The cannon is mounted internally with 182 rounds for the F-35A or in an external pod with 220 rounds for the F-35B and F-35C. The cannon pod has stealth features as well. Software that enables operational firing of the cannon is expected to be installed in 2018. The F-35 fighter has external hardpoints to carry missiles, bombs and fuel tanks at the cost of increasing its radar cross-section and thus reducing its stealth. These include four underwing pylons that can carry the AIM-120 Amram BVR, AGM-158 Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile, JSSM, Cruise Missile, Guided Bombs, and two pylons near the wingtips for the AIM-9X Sidewinder and AIM-132 Osram short-range air-to-air missiles AAM, dot. The F-35 fighter has two internal weapons bays with a total of four weapon stations. Two of them can carry air-to-ground missiles or bombs up to 2,000 pounds, 910 kilograms, each in the A and C models, 
or air missiles or bombs up to 1,000 pounds, 450 kilograms, each in the B model. The other two stations are for smaller weapons such as air-to-air -air missiles. The weapons bay can carry the AIM-120 AMRAM, AIM-132 Osram, Direct Joint Strike Ammunition, JDM, Paveway Bomb Series, Joint Standoff Weapon, JSOW, Brimstone, Spear 3 Anti-Tank Missile, and Wind Corrected Munitions Dispenser. An air-to-air -air missile payload of 8 AIM-120s and 2 AIM-9s can be carried using internal and external weapon stations. A configuration of 6 2,000-pound, 910 kilograms, bombs, 2 AIM-120s and 2 AIM-9s can also be arranged. The Terma AS Multi-Mission Pod, MMP, can be used for different equipment and purposes, such as electronic warfare aerial reconnaissance, or rear-facing tactical radar. The UK Ministry of Defense plans to launch the Ability-3 Select Precision Effects at Range Spear missile from the F-35B's internal chambers, with four missiles stored per chamber. The U.S. is very serious about increasing the strength of its air fleet to become stronger. As evidenced by the U.S. plan, the U.S. is spending such a large budget. What kind of technological sophistication is installed on the U.S. F-35 fighter? Here we will discuss sensors and avionics first. But what kind of sensors and avionics are installed on the fifth-generation stealth fighter so as to make it the most advanced stealth fighter today? Listen to the explanation. The mission system of the F-35 is one of the most complex aspects of the aircraft. The combination of avionics and sensors is designed to enhance situational awareness and pilot command and control capabilities and facilitate network-centric warfare capabilities. Key sensors include the Northrop Grumman and Slash APG-81 Active Electronically Scanned Array, ASA, Radar, BAE Systems and Slash ASQ-239 Barracuda Electronic Warfare System. Northrop Grumman slash Raytheon and slash AQ-37 Electro-Optical Distributed Aperture System, DS, Lockheed Martin and slash AQ-40 Electro-Optical Targeting System, EOTS, and Northrop Grumman and slash ASQ-242 Communications, Navigation, and Identification, CNI. The F-35 fighter is designed with intersensor communications to provide a cohesive picture of the local battle space and availability for any possible use and combination of each other. For example, the APG-81 radar also acts as part of the electronic warfare system, EOTS, and the Northrop Grumman and Slash ASQ-242 communications. Navigation and Identification CNI Package the F-35 is designed with intersensor communication to provide a cohesive picture of the local battle space and availability for any possible use and combination of each other. For example, the APG-81 radar also acts as part of the electronic warfare system. Most of the F-35 fighter software is developed in the C and C programming languages. While ADA-83 code from the F-22 fighter is also used, the Block 3F software has 8.6 million lines of code. The Green Hill Software Integrity Do 178B Real-Time Operating System RTUS, runs on an integrated core processor ICP. The data network includes IEEE 1394B and fiber channel buses. To enable fleet software upgrades for software-defined radio systems and greater upgrade flexibility and affordability, the avionics use commercial off-the-shelf COTS components where possible. Mission system software, particularly for sensor fusion, is one of the most difficult parts of the program and is responsible for considerable program delays. The APG-81 radar uses electronic scanning for fast beam agility and incorporates passive and active air-to-air -air modes, attack modes, and synthetic aperture radar SAR, capabilities, with multiple scans while tracking targets at ranges over 80 nmi. 150 kilometers. The antenna is tilted back for stealth. Complementing the radar is the AQ-37DS, which consists of six infrared sensors that provide missile launch warning and all-round target tracking. The DS serves as a situational awareness infrared seeker and tracker SIRSD, and provides infrared imagery and helmet visibility to the pilot. 
The ASQ-239 Barracuda's electronic warfare system has 10 radio frequency antennas embedded in the wing and tail edges for radar warning receivers, RWR. The system also provides radio frequency sensor fusion and infrared tracking functions, geolocated threat targeting, and multispectral image countermeasures for self-defense against missiles. This electronic warfare system is capable of detecting and disrupting enemy radars. The AQ-40 EOTS is mounted internally behind a low-slung observable window under the nose and performs laser targeting, forward infrared, FLIR, and long-range IRSD functions. The ASQ-242 CNI Sweep uses half a dozen different physical links, including a directional multifunction advanced data link, MADL, for covert CNI functions. Through sensor fusion, information from radio frequency receivers and infrared sensors is combined to form a single tactical picture for the pilot. Direction and target identification from all aspects can be shared via MADL to other platforms without compromising low observation capability, while Link 16 is present for communication with legacy systems. The F-35 fighter was designed from the start to incorporate better processors, sensors and software upgrades over its lifetime. Technology Refresh 3, which includes a new core processor and a new cockpit display, is planned for Lot 15 aircraft. Lockheed Martin has offered advanced EOTS for the Block 4 configuration. The upgraded sensors correspond to the same areas as the base EOTS with minimal changes. In June 2018, Lockheed Martin selected Raytheon to upgrade the DS. The USAF has been studying the potential of the F-35 fighter to organize attacks by unmanned combat aerial vehicles UCAVs, through its sensors and communications equipment. A new radar called an slash APG-85 is planned for the Block 4 F-35. According to JPO, this new radar will be compatible with all three main variants of the F-35 fighter. However, it is unclear whether older aircraft will be equipped with the new radar. The F-35 fighter aircraft has so many advanced and modern technologies today. However, in this video we only discuss about production costs, sensors, and avionics for the future and want to discuss about other technologies. Comment.